Hi, Pox here with the Two Smart Guys Show. Every week we bring you the latest and greatest in hacking technology and just cool things that I find interesting. Uh, that being said, two things that I find interesting are the iPad 2 and its two cameras and the fact that you can import video from other cameras that shoot at 720p 60 frames per second at H.264 low bitrate. <laughs> I know that's a mouthful, but basically it means the blog works, the Hero HD works in 720p. This is being shot right now on the Hero HD, and I'm going to show you some samples of footage from the other cameras. And for the first time ever, my episode is being edited entirely on the iPad 2 and uploaded to you. This is footage from the Sony Bloggy running at 720p. It's uh, just another camera that you're able to import into the iPad 2 and run it and edit it in the third party movie editing software, uh, Real Movie. So, this is the forward facing camera on the iPad. It's interesting because it's so large and so close, you need to look at the camera on the side of it. Otherwise, if you look at the screen on yourself, it always looks like you're looking to the left. <laughs> But, I don't know, the quality in, in good lighting conditions isn't too bad. It's pretty grainy in low light, though. This is the iPhone 4's forward-facing camera, the front camera on the iPhone 4. Should be uh, pretty much identical to the one that's on both the iPad 2 and iPods. These don't work too bad in most lighting conditions. They're more grainy and darker ones, but this looks pretty decent to me. Just low res is all. Same issue, though. You need to be looking at the little dot, otherwise you're looking at the side of the screen. Not as noticeable on the iPad 2, though. Or, it's more noticeable on the iPad 2. Alright, so this is the rear-facing camera on the iPad, and it's actually very difficult to hold out and record yourself, because you have to look at the little tiny dot and make sure you have it angled right. It's not too low or too high. <laughs> but the quality should be fairly decent. This is a 1 megapixel camera on the back. Alright, so this is the iPhone 4's back camera. It's a 720p camera. It should be a lot higher quality. Uh, although you can't see yourself when you're doing something like this. So it's hard to tell if you where the framing is at. <laughs> so post in the comments below. Let me know which camera you think is the best. I mean, it theoretically should be this one, but it, who knows? Maybe the other cameras work better because they have a lower megapixel. Maybe they have better low light capabilities. Oh. Alright, so this is a test of 720p, 60 frames per second footage. Alright, so those are the cameras. Uh, take a look at the footage again, post below what you think has the best looking quality, the least graininess. Uh, keep in mind there's only two lights on me, so this isn't the brightest area, so this is all considered low light footage. Um, subscribe to the feed if you like our videos. At least once a week we do a new video on hacking. So check it out, twosmartguys.com or uh, right here on this YouTube channel. Subscribe to the feed. Subscribe to the feed. This has been the Two Smart Guys production.